Correct, Chris. In 2004, I was the uh, the chief master at arms on board the USS Princeton, and the the technology that we witnessed with the Tic Tac was something that we would not have been able to defend our forces against at the time. Help me understand that as a as the uninitiated. What does that mean to us? Well, sir, that that means that what we what we saw in the Tic Tac and what Mr. Luis Elizondo describes as the five observables uh, indicate a technology that outstrips our arsenal by at least a hundred to a thousand years at the moment. A hundred to a thousand years. So, uh, meaning, like, what kind of technology was at play that you were able to identify it, but know that you can't match it? It's well, first of all, the aircraft had zero control surfaces. It had no means of propulsion that we could detect. It moved at hypersonic velocities, uh, and it preceded the pilots to their cap point. So it seemed to have some uh, knowledge of where the, ca the pilots were headed ahead of time. And we don't possess those abilities to do that uh, in our arsenal at the moment. So I hesitate to speculate on the source, but I can tell you that I don't believe that this is within our arsenal of, of any human technology at the moment. So when you say that, it almost guarantees that not just your good looks, but that statement will get this picked up and sent all over the Internet because there'll be a legit military person saying that maybe this is from outer space. 